they share that with the rest of the organisation. I think uh, return on investment is always going to be a bit of a, an issue with uh, social networking, so it's really good to get that message out there that it is successful and it does um, reach your supporters. So I thought that was a very useful moment. Uh, it seems to me what, what you measure and how you decide what your success is depends on what, what your organisation is. So, not an awful lot of uh, charities would, would, would count uh, me as a dog, dog as a success, whereas you would. Um, so, what you measure will go back to what your what your mission is, really. And I don't know, something that I found well, quite useful is just thinking about um, who you're measuring it for. So, there's a difference between um, this might link from the other groups, it's like measuring stuff so you can prove it's effective to your managers or to your senior managers or whatever, so that you might need whatever it is that they're going to be keen on. It might be number of followers, even if you don't think that number of followers is really important. Um, or it might be because you want to make sure that you're doing the you know, most effective tweeting that you're doing. So that might be, you know, whatever, it's you know, number of retweets or whatever it is. So what you are interested in, what your managers are interested in, might be different things. And so you might just need to you know, measure them differently. But just keep it clear in your head why you're measuring stuff. And whether you really need to. You can just have a smiley face for good things. You know, unsmiley face for not good things. Or whatever. You know, feel good points. Could be good. Yeah, thanks Ian. Um, I suppose too it's a case of working out what the measurements really mean. Did you talk much about that? You know, actually thinking about the metrics, a lot of people will talk about numbers or response rates or click-throughs or you know, things like this online, but actually what really matters, have you got any thoughts? You're saying sometimes that <coughs> you miss the journey. Say so you, you measure the number of click-throughs to the site but actually miss what's happening after that and where you're losing people. So maybe that would actually be useful because that tells you not only how many people have you engaged to come over to your site, but actually what's wrong with your site as well uh, <coughs> and how you can fix it. So sometimes we measure some things but we're stopping too early and sometimes you can measure everything at once and analyse yourself to death and actually get nothing useful out of it because you spend so much time looking at numbers that they don't mean anything. 